Alright guys, so I'm back with another episode of Feed the Beast, and you may have noticed in the last few episodes I've had this little dew hoppy uh, hanging around, and some of you might know what this is and some of you might not. What this is, it is the uh, modular power suit uh, thing I'm a bobber. I uh, forget exactly what it is. Um, let's see if we can find it. There it is. It's Power Armor Tinker Table. That's what it's called. And um, basically, you need an emerald, an electronic circuit, and a machine block. Now, the reason I have this is I was kind of messing around in, in creative mode, trying to figure out um, how to use it and stuff and, and, and everything. And So right now, I've got some Power Armor feet. They don't have anything on them. As you can see, they're, they're completely empty. Uh, but we're going to put some stuff on it. And... Uh, we're also going to do some legs and a helmet, I think. I'm going to leave the lap pack alone, but I need some armor. And I need some armor that's not going to, uh, you know, just die every single time that I try and do anything. <laughs> so that's what we're going to work on today. Hmm. All right, so let's go ahead and get started, I guess. Um, basically, what I first need to do is make one of these. Make an advanced battery. Now, you're probably thinking, why don't, make you, why don't you just make a basic battery? And the problem with the basic battery is there is no um, recipe for the LV capacitor, which kind of sucks. But oh well. Uh, so instead, we have to make an MV capacitor, uh, which uses, I think, a diamond. Well, it uses a um, redstone, red circuit thingy, my bobber. Hold on, let me look. I forget what they're called. Um, yes, energy crystal, that's it. And then this wiring. Um, so everyone knows how to make those pretty much. And the wiring is gold cable with redstone. And I just so happen somewhere, probably in here. There we go. I've got 20 of these things that I've used from previous stuff. Um, so let's grab some redstone. And let's just make a whole, let's just make all this into wiring. So we're going to need it, trust me. Uh, so we got 20 pieces of wiring now. And let's go ahead and make a um, energy crystal. So here you go. There is our first MV capacitor. Uh, so basically what this is, is it's a battery. Um, now I have it in my inventory. So now you can see that install is lit up. And I can press it. And boom, there we go. We have it ready and installed. Now I can... Uh, change this how I need to, to how much it's going to actually hold um, so I can change this all the way up and it's going to cost it's going to weigh 10 kilograms but it's going to hold up to 500 kilojoules which is quite a bit um, so far we don't have any armor yet which is what we're going to work on here in a bit but first let's get out of here and there you guys you can see it already came with some energy but um, we have a little bit more to get so let's go ahead and I think, I'm not completely sure, I think you can charge them inside these energy cells. No, you can't. You have to use some some way you have to um, make them, you know, you have to charge them. So let's get this back open again. I think I should probably just leave this open, huh? All the time. So let's see. I think we can charge them in here. Yep, there it goes. Starts going up. Now it doesn't uh, really cost a lot of energy, uh, but this is going to last quite a bit of time. So right now these boots don't have really any special abilities, and that's why I've got these on still. Because right now what we need to do is let's figure out what else we can put on. First I need to put some shock absorbers on. So we're going to need two pieces of wool and two servo motors. Now these servo mo motors are not cheap. Uh, as you can see here it costs a machine block, electric cernic, and solenoids. Now solenoids are a machine block covered in wiring. So as you can see um, it starts to really kind of add up quite quickly on how much this is going to cost. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to... Why is that not working? Is it... Oh. Did the... Uh, <laughs> So I'm going to leave machine blocks in here because we're going to need three, but I'm going to leave that recipe in there for now. Uh, so we're going to need 
two of these um, solenoids, and then like I like I said before, we need to make um, some electronic circuits. I'm actually gonna make five electronic circuits. Why not? Uh, we're gonna need them eventually, so it doesn't really matter that much. Um, uh, actually, let's just do it like, whoops, let's do one of these awesome things. Oh wait, I don't, I'm not in the crafty table, JK, JK, I'm a little off today, guys. Wait, why isn't that working? Oh, I don't have the refined iron. Go, let's take some of that, nope, that, there we go. There we go, awesome, finally got that. Now let's make the, um... What was it? Servo motor. Now that was just one servo motor. We're gonna need another one on top of it. So let's go ahead. That's why I made some more of these. Oh, I didn't make enough solenoids. Crap. So as you can see, I've already used a whole stack of refined iron. So this is gonna take quite a bit of you know, materials to do this kind of stuff. But uh, it's totally worth it, I think, in the long run. Um, it's, I think these are actually a little bit better than, um, a little bit better than the, you know, like, nano and quantum stuff because it is completely customizable to what you want it to do. Um, so, now we should be able to install this. And now, um, here you go, energy, impact energy consumption, so how much energy it's going to use each time you hit and how much reduction it's going to be. So this is going to be 100%. So this is going to work um, exactly like these long fall boots basically. I'm going to have unlimited amounts but as you can see up in the corner there when I hit the ground it's going to take some out. Now I can't actually see that because my thing's in the way but I think it only took out one yeah it only took out 1k because it only took out like 10 uh, joules or something or whatever you want to call it. Uh, hold on. <coughs> oh, bless me. Whew. All right, so there you go. That's pretty simple. Yeah, it only it only takes ten joules per impact. Uh, so next, let's go ahead. Um, we need some armor. So there's there's three types of armor that you can do: iron, diamond, and energy. Now this energy one is always going to take uh, away energy from you, and it's gonna but it's gonna be a lot more um, advanced you know um, but we're also gonna try and make this custom color module because it's pretty cool uh, so wait let's quickly see so we just need advanced plating or basic plating let's see what those cost because I'm not sure uh, here we go advanced plating Ooh, five diamonds yeah and an advanced circuit let's just stick with one of these um, we've got enough material so let's go ahead and get, I think it's just one, that's all we needed. And while we're at it, let's get the color module. Uh, if I can find it. Is that it? No. Whoops. What was it called? I forget. I forget. Hologram emitter, that's right. Um, Holo gram there we go so just one wiring four glass and we need glowstone dust lapis red rose and cactus green so let's get out where are they colors there's red rose we can turn that into green my minium stone and then we need oops wrong one we need a piece of glowstone and a piece of lapis only one there we go so let's turn this into green. Uh, where's green? There it is. Whoops. Threw out my rubber. Alright. So let's... Oh, I need some glass. I didn't pick up any glass. Down here. There we go. Four pieces of glass. Okay. Um, sweet. So let's get this ready. And... Uh, if I can remember off the top of my head, I think that's right. There we go. So let's um, 
put both of these in there we'll install that and then now we can um, choose what color we want and then what was the splitting install that and now let's go ahead and push it all the way up so it's going to weigh a little bit more now um, which can come at a disadvantage but we're going to get five points um, which is two and a half of these um, chest plate pieces of armor so let's change this what should we do um, let's make it let's see what blue yeah see we can make it bright blue set we make them black hmm what should we do what should we do what's a good color let's make them red yeah let's just make them bright red because then oh yeah that looks cool let me uh switch oh yeah oh yeah oh yeah I'm cool I'm fly got my red boots on oh yeah oh yeah okay anyway let's get back and let's make now uh, first off before we get going too much I've got another stack of this but let's refine another bit while we're waiting uh, it's a furnace um, so I think we're gonna need an another some of the, some more of these. Let's check. I'm gonna make the legs next. Oh, excuse me. Um, so it's just two electronic circuits and refined iron. We do have two electronic circuits left. Um, yeah, let's just go ahead and do that. Let's. Oops. There we go. Okay, we got the legs. Now we should be able to. There they are. So obviously there's some different things that we can do, uh, but we're gonna need another battery. Uh, so let me get the another diamond. I've only got one, but I don't know if I've shown you this on camera, but I can make more diamonds using this little guy. Put that in there, and you just need to split this up, and you can get some more diamonds. Pretty simple, um, and it helps out quite a lot, because uh, everyone always has more gold than what they really need. So there we go. We got another one of them, and we're gonna need some more of this wiring stuff, which means we need more gold wiring. So let's get. Yeah, that'll be enough, because that makes each one makes twelve, I think. Yeah, that's plenty. Let's just turn that all into wiring. And then, where is it? There it is. Get our MV capacitor. Oops, wrong wrong piece. So let's just shove that in there and turn the battery life up all the way. Uh, so we'll get some more iron plating. And then, let's see, what can we do? Uphill assist. No, jump assist, sprint assist. There we go. So we need s four servo motors. Okay. Oh my goodness. That's a lot of stuff. Not even joking. Uh, so, but let's go ahead. Let's try it. Why not? Um, so you can see there, and my power just jumped up. As you can see, it's from to one mega joule, from K KJ to MJ. Uh, so that's pretty nice. Uh, that that adds together like that. We're also gonna make the helmet, but we'll do that in a bit. Uh, so, what do we need? Servo motors. Servo motos. Um, so we're gonna need one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Twelve machine blocks. So let's make. There's seven. See how many this can make. Twelve. Awesome. Worked out. <laughs> and then we're gonna need four. One, two, three, four of the electronic circuits. So let's make that stuff now. Let's just do it like this because it's a little bit quicker, I think. Um do I have everything I need? I need some more redstone, I think. So let's just grab that and 
We'll make four of those. Good. Um, ooh, okay, so we need some more wiring. Right, because we're going to need two, three, four. We need eight, yes. Yeah, so we need some more wiring, so let's grab some more. Um, oops. That would be good. Oops, I grabbed a few too many. Awesome. That should be enough. Uh, so let's make these now. Got them, and let's get these out. Boom. Not too bad. I mean, it does cost quite a bit, but it'll be worth it. So let's install that. So, so what's this do? Um, that increases that sprint speed multiplier. Exhaustion compensation. Oh, okay, 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 I get it. So that's going to cost 12 joules, probably per second, I guess. Uh, which is fine. And before I do anything else, I'm going to get another one of those do hoppies, whatever you want to call it. Where's the red? There's the red. And there's the green. Whoops. Got my minium stone. There we go. Uh, a one piece of glowstone, one piece of lapis, and four pieces of glass. Hollow. Boom. Got it. Um, okay. Uh, if you guys haven't guessed, I'm, I'm going for a flash kind of look. Uh, so there we go. Uh, so now we can stick those on. Awesome. Look at me go. So obviously I can walk normal, but then I can... Now what I think I'm going to do is if you hit K, you can... Um, you adjust what you want so you can make a new key so whatever you want um, let's see I think peace safe and you can attach stuff to it um, so if you watch I can run well, if I hit P it says toggle to print assist off and now I'm just running normal uh, so it's a little little trick pretty cool uh, so I can turn that on and off. I think I'm going to link it to a button that's on my mouse since I've got a whole bunch now. I'm going to link it to one of those and uh, that'll be pretty nice I think. Um, so I can just click that on and off whenever I need it. And I'm not sure but I guess this will work too. So let's see if I hit P Turn those on, hit P again, yeah, it turns back to the normal colors. So that's interesting, that's something, you know, a little, a little interesting, but we can take that off. Uh, we can also put that on P, but I'm going to leave that on all the time, because uh, I don't want to accidentally die. Let me hit P again, turn that off. Oh, yeah. oh wait, no, I can't do it up here, I have to go here. Uh, I need some more coal, it seems like, as well. Um, so let's grab these off and make... Oops. Crap, that actually drained the power out of it. That's weird. Uh, so that should go... Yep, come on. Let's go. Taking forever. There we go. Cool, and then all I need left is a helmet, which we will make right now so let's look up the um, what it's gonna cost uh, where is it uh, is that, no that's not it um, no do they not I know they have a helmet what's it called though um, actually we can just look here do, 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 do. Modular power suits. Oh, it's a head. Okay, it's called head. 
There it is. So we need two more electronic circuits and some more refined iron. Oops. There it is, refined iron. Oops. Let's stick another another stack of iron down to the furnace. Um yeah, let's turn that off now. Because I don't need it. Um so two electronic circuits. So let's grab some more rubber. So as you can see I'm actually going a little bit slower than normal if I take this off. That's how fast I go and then if I put it back on you see I go a lot slower. Uh, also I don't jump nearly as high I don't think as I used to. Uh, but don't worry that'll be compensated eventually when I make uh, you know in, either I'm going to do jet booster or I'm going to do the um, uh, the jump assist thingy. I'm not sure which one yet. Um, but, well, first we need to make some copper cables. So let's you know, let's hit you on this actually, because that'll be easier. Uh, so there we go. We can make a bunch of these. So let's make. Uh, yeah, that'll be good. We can always make more if we need to. Um, and then we can use these to make, where are they? Huh, where are they? That's weird. There they are. So let's make four like we did last time for now. Um, and there we go, we can make a helmet, cool. So obviously we're gonna need another one of them. Uh, oh, I already have it on me, so let's, Nah, we're good. Um, I'm going to need another one of these energy crystals, obviously. So let's go ahead and grab one and put some stuff around it. There we go. Uh, so now we have the head, and we can install this and increase the size all the way up. So this uh, lets you breathe underwater, and then, of course, the normal platings. I don't think we made the plating for the last one, so we need to do that. So let's, do I have enough refined iron? I think I do. So let's get plating. Yeah, good, I have enough. So we need to put it on here and we're just gonna increase all the way. Because why not? And then the same thing, install it here. And now, uh, um, Oh, I don't have it on me. Duh. There we go. So now you can see I've got just about as good as iron armor with only three actual things on. Oh, that's cool. You can have it show goggles of revealing. Oh, that is really cool. I might I might just have to do that. Uh, but anyway, we've got that. We've got one of them. So we can't actually make a water electrolyzer, but I think I'm, I'm just going to uh, cheat this in because uh, I do want a like, water electrolyzer, but you can't even make an LV capacitor, so um, it's kind of pointless. And then, of course, we'll make a, a color module as well. So let me go ahead. I'm just going to cheat in one of those LV capacitors because that's like the main reason I wanted one of these things. So let's grab one. Let's take this back to normal mode and install this. Uh, so there you go. It doesn't have a slidable thingy, uh, you know. But every time you need, you know, a some watt or some air, it'll uh, jolt some more air into you. I guess I'm not, I'm not exactly sure how, but uh, it will. Uh, so now you can see I move really slow. So that's kind of one of the disadvantages uh, to the armor plating, especially. So I'm going to turn this down to 3, turn this down to 3 if I can, come on, come on, go, and I'll turn this down to 3 as well, and hopefully that should counteract some of the problem that I'm going to have. And not really, I'm still pretty slow. Um, so what I can do is this doesn't need to be as high of energy 
So I'm going to move this to 150. Uh, this I shouldn't need a lot either, but I'm going to move it to 250, I think. Oop, I passed it. There we go. Now that should sort of fix it. So that's the disadvantage to this is as you put more stuff on your gadgets, uh, you're you're going to decrease. Um, I think that doesn't actually affect any of the weight. Um, shock absorber, that doesn't affect the weight either, but we can bring this down. We don't need it to be that high. We'll put it at halfway, 300. Come on, come on, 300. There we go. Oh, I don't want it to be some weird number. Okay, there we go. Eh, we're pretty much back to normal. But if I hit P anyway, we're going to be running pretty fast. So once I lock that to one of my keys on my mouse, we'll be using it a lot. Oh, there you go. Watch that. Oh, that is fast. Oh, that is so cool. Cool. Um, <laughs> so that should be helpful with getting around pretty, pretty nicely. Um... So we shouldn't need that stuff. Well, let's keep it for a minute because we might. Um, one thing left to do is either decide to do the jump assist, which is going to take four more servo motors, or do the jet boots. Not as strong as a jetpack, but could enough to. So let's see how much one of these ion thrusters cost. Uh. There it is. Oh my goodness. Uh, so it's probably cheaper to go with the go the other way, but still, I mean, um, oh wow, that, the helmet looks awesome. Um, did I install this? No, I didn't. I don't have one yet. But uh, yeah, that's basically uh, what I wanted to do this episode. It's probably gonna be a shorter one, but uh, just wanted to get those you know going and stuff because they it looks awesome. I mean. It really does. Uh, it looks awesome, and it's just really cool that you're able to customize it to like your heart's consent, basically. Um, but before I go, let's decide on which one of these we need. We want to do. So obviously, oh yeah, I don't want to do all that stuff yet. Advanced alloys and everything. Yeah, let's just do the jump assist. That's on the power legs. Yeah. Let's do that. Um, so we're going to need four more of those servo motors. Uh, which kind of sucks, but um, it's alright. We'll, we'll get through it. Uh, so we're going to need... How many more? How many did we decide the first time? What? Twelve, right? Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Oops. Oops. Uh-oh, I might not have enough. Uh-oh, I need some more. Shit. Okay. So I'll make some more of this stuff, and I'll be back with you guys as soon as it's um, done and we're ready to keep going. All right, guys, I'm back, and I've created the uh, last piece or the those last few pieces, those servo motors. Um, just been looking at some of these other things. Pretty cool. But uh, we're going to stick with this. So, uh, as you can see, compensation. This is this is the w the food whole system stuff. I um, actually don't really care that much. Five thirty, but we're not. We don't want to jump that high anyway. Uh, let's see what. Basically, I want I want to be able to jump maybe. Uh, two blocks, I think. Oh yeah, I think that's that's plenty. I think. Let's go ahead and look. Oh my gosh. Yeah, I think that's high enough. I think that's good enough. Probably could take it down even more, actually. Um, but yeah, I want it to be. A I want to be able to jump two blocks, because I, I think that's really helpful. Uh, there's a lot of places where you can get kind of stuck if you don't. If you're not able to do that, so let's see if we can. Yeah, that should be good. Awesome. So.
so now we've got that as well and the last thing I wanted to show you guys is that um, ooh, what happened it's weird um, let's see what's this that and that there's so now you can connect those two so like I said I can really kinda jump around you know pretty nice actually but I can also hit P turn it off and I'm normal now I can only I can only jump one block barely now uh, as you can see uh, I could barely jump up on there if I take this stuff off you can see how much of a difference I mean, I really it really does kind of hinder me a little bit but not enough to make me worry that much uh, but this is going to be really cool using this around and stuff and like I said I'm going to key bind it and everything to make it real nice um, where are they? there they are let's get those uh, but yeah I'm going to key bind it to one of my one of my keys on my mouse and make it all work real nice and be awesome uh, like I was doing before I'm just gonna make real quickly one of these uh, hollow gram emitters um, what am I missing? oh I didn't actually change this stuff yet probably, doesn't that work? doesn't work does it? oh crap um, which means I need to go actually I don't have to go anywhere I'm thinking I've got some right here. That works out because the red's there and the green is next. Awesome. So let's go ahead and get these now. So now I'm going to be ducked out in nice red suit. Um. Oh yeah, I look awesome. Whoops, I <laughs> hit the wrong key there. Sorry. Uh, but I look pretty sweet, I must say. Um, eventually maybe I'll make a chest plate if I want to and I can make it yellow I can be a flash uh, but phew, see me running I'm so cool Ooh. oops a little close <laughs> but yeah pretty cool uh, if you like this video uh, please hit the like button uh, share the video and favorite the video because that helps out a whole lot if you are annoyed by that spider please hit the like button because so am I but he's not even going to come down. He's a little fraidy cat. And I can't actually jump that high. So, <laughs> uh, but, but yeah, anyway, like, favorite, um, share. And if you're not subscribed to me, hit subscribe. We're on our way to 100 uh, subscribers. And it, it'll help out a lot if you would do that. So, um, have a great day, guys. Goodbye.